What if you could turn your phone, your tablet, or any mobile device into a public survey station? Well, you can with kiosk mode. Let me show you how. Hey, job formers, welcome back. I'm Kimberly. And as you can see, I am currently on my mobile device and kiosk mode basically locks a form on your screen and then automatically refreshes whenever someone finishes it. And then your data is stored in your JotForm account. This is really great for something like a survey, or if you're working out in the field with spotty Wi-Fi, you can still collect data and feedback without having to worry about the submission data not being saved. So let me show you how to access kiosk mode and turn it on and all the different features that come along with kiosk mode. So for this example, I'm going to go ahead and utilize my survey form. So I'm going to choose my survey form and then down at the bottom, you can see where it says kiosk mode. I'm going to click on that and we have a lot of different options. So the very top one is kiosk lock. So do you want to lock that form on your screen so people can't exit out themselves? So I'm going to go ahead and of course that is on and we can see my four digit pin is currently one, two, three, four. You can change that to make that fit you perfectly. So I'm gonna go ahead and set that password. Next, we have touchless mode. If you would prefer people to not utilize your device, maybe give them the option to scan that QR code and go about their day. You can do that as well. For this example, I'm going to go ahead and leave that off. Next, we have inactivity timeout. If you would like to have it time out, you can do that right now. It's set for one minute, but again, we can always turn that off. If we head back, we also have that thank you page display. So this is going to be the page that says thank you for your submission, but how long do you want that page to be up on the screen? We have lots of different options from two seconds all the way up to five minutes. So what I would do is I would definitely test this out yourself. I've tried two seconds before and to me it seems really fast. So I like the five second option. So let's go ahead and choose done here. Let's head back. And then we have the visible exit kiosk button. In kiosk mode, the exit button is hidden. So if we don't want anyone tampering with getting out of the form, even if they might not know the password. I'd like to leave that off so we can see here to exit. We're going to use two fingers to swipe down. If we turn it on, we can see that X in the top right hand corner. So let's go ahead and turn that off. We'll exit out and let's go ahead and launch kiosk mode and see what this looks like. So we can see that right here. It says how to exit kiosk mode. We have the swipe down option with two fingers. So it's going to go ahead and disappear. So let's go ahead and give ourselves some ratings. We'll do submit and we can see the five seconds. Again, two seconds is really fast. You might prefer two seconds completely up to you. Let's go ahead and give us five stars. And if we want, we can choose exit kiosk mode right here. But I'm going to go ahead and swipe down exit kiosk mode. We'll enter in our pin continue and we're good to go. So now all of our data is here. We can view our submissions and here they all are. And it really is as simple as that. If you have any other questions about utilizing kiosk mode, definitely let us know down below in the comments. If you like this video and you got some value, hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe and turn on the bell so you get notification every time we put out a new video. I'll see you next time.